Two weeks after Super Typhoon Haiyan tore through parts of the Philippines, residents like Arturo Mobia are trying to rebuild their lives. He lost everything, his home, his business, and most importantly, four members of his family. With scraps of corrugated roof and driftwood, Mobia says it's every man for himself. To rebuild this, we need to rely on ourselves first temporarily. There are so many of us here. The government can't accommodate everyone. For others, the massive and far-reaching devastation is reminiscent of a past era. It's as if we got hurled back into the days of MacArthur, this man said. We have to start from scratch. Besides a roof over their head, typhoon survivors still need food, water and other supplies. Although more aid is flowing into the region, officials say graft and corruption issues complicate the distribution. With cleanup and rebuilding far from over, survivors continue to struggle with their daily existence. The death toll across the Philippines is now over 4,000 people.